Well, I got a question for you, Vince. You're you're sort of known for being quite uh, accessible and interactive with fans, wrestling fans. But is it ever difficult talking to fans? Because I went to this uh, Bruce Pritchard live show the other night, and I was looking around in the room, and I thought, kind of weird. Kind of weird, like how? Like, what do you mean? Like, uh, re- like, like I, I, I know I'm nerdy. But these guys, it was like they were dre- dressing up and caught in fancy dresses, yeah. nerds. Yeah. You know, bro, that's the thing. It's like I, I, I like having interaction with um, – and I hate using the word fans. I hate that. But people that support me, I like interacting with them. But, um, yeah, bro, like I, I think sometimes they take it way too seriously. And, like, there are so many times where I'll say, guys – it's it was just a television show i mean that's all it is it's a television show and i think it's great that you enjoy it and you're fans of it i think that's great but it's like man i i I see people become obsessive over it and bro i think when you become obsessive over anything I just don't think that's good, man, and I don't think that's healthy. And and I'll tell people that sometimes. I'll, I'll say to them, bro, if you're paying this much attention to wrestling, you're probably neglecting something in your life that's very important. That's true. You know, I tell I tell them that all the time. Yeah, and plus, uh, I always I don't like it when fans go on about kayfabe because. Yeah. They've got no problem when Brian Cranston's hanging around with Aaron Paul and they're promoting uh, Breaking Bad DVDs. But if if Shawn Michaels is seen having a coffee with John Cena, they're all shitting themselves. Yeah, no, that's what I'm saying, bro. Some some of them just take it way too far. 